I'm here in the Walmart parking lot. Uh, it is, let's see, it is 1238 right now. I'm going to go inside and pick up my um, Ozarks Trail imitation Yeti stainless steel cup that I got for only $7.50. I think it's a heck of a deal, but I wanted a cup that I'm going to use all the time, so that's going to be it. Um, as I pulled in the parking lot, I did, I saw only one schoolie. I saw a little uh, yellow short bus over there. It looks like there's probably people living in it. I would imagine. I mean, the, the letters are spray painted out on the side. It looks like I can see light inside. It looks like they have just tinted windows with nothing covering the windows. And um, it's just lit up inside a little bit. Like, uh, there might be people in there. But it could just be lit from the street, street sign, so... I don't know. I'm going to check it out a little further once I'm done inside getting what I need to from Walmart. I don't know if there's anybody here. Is there any way I can pick up something I've ordered online? Online. I think you only do it during the day. What? How late? No, no. I ordered online. Item. Nine o'clock. Pretty weak. Can't pick up online. Can't pick up online purchases. Past nine o'clock. I have a backup plan. I ordered the cup online, and it's here at the store. If I buy one, if I buy one, then I can just return it and still get the same price. So I'm gonna see. I don't want to leave here empty-handed. Ah, let's see. I'm in the right vicinity. Nope. They don't have the variety that I ordered here. I'm leaving empty handed. Bummer. I gotta get used to this vlogging inside. I don't care if people think I'm a weirdo or not. You know how tempted I am to buy cereal? Extremely. Cereal and chocolate. And Sour Patch Kids. I hate this place. <laughs> I won't be staying at very many Walmarts, I don't think. So, I'm gonna go for a little walk over by the schoolie. There's my car. Way down there is the schoolie. School bus. <laughs> Look at this car. I like it. So there's the bus. I'm just gonna kind of walk up on it, just walk past it and see what it looks like. But there's really no activity out here. Uh, I don't think there's, I'm gonna drive, oh no, I see somebody down on the other end of the parking lot. We'll see, I'm gonna head down there next. Certainly doesn't seem to be anybody living in it. Still has seats in it. Very odd. So I'm just gonna head back to my car. I'm gonna go down to the other end of the parking lot because I see a full-size van down there. 
that could definitely have people in it that are van dwellers. So I'm gonna go check that out. Yeah, the Walmart location that I'm at is on Colonial Drive um, in East Orlando. So I just thought it'd be good to let you guys know what kind of area I was talking about. Yeah, I just came up here to see if there were some van dwellers and to get my uh, cup, but the cup is not retrievable. So now I'm just up here looking for van dwellers. There's a full-size van over here that I'm going to kind of roll up on and see what it looks like. Might be occupied. I don't know. So it seems that the dome light in my car is just burned out, so I'm using the street light for light right now. Um, yeah, I think there was van dwellers in that van back there. They had one vent window popped open, and it was in the middle of the um, night at a Walmart. So uh, there's one more van down here I want to go check out. I think it may be occupied as well. Van Dweller for sure. Had the window open and everything. Oh yeah. So I think we have some more suspects here. We got a little uh, Ford Transit with a roof vent. And the back is blocked off. Very neat. Here we have a uh, huge tractor trailer kind of thing with a sleeper. And we over here we have a Ford Econoline van. I really dig the little transit. It's cool. Here's a Suzuki Serio Aereo. And here's the Ford Econoline. It looks like uh, the Camry is also a uh, dweller as well. Interesting. Very interesting. Certainly not an, ex an exciting episode today, but uh, yeah, I got to see a couple van dwellers. I think I'm gonna head home now and call it quits for the evening. Yeah. Oh, tomorrow I have an appointment at 9 a.m. to bring my step van in, um, get an oil change and general inspection, make sure everything's in good working order so that I can start driving it. I worked on getting my business license all day today, and I gotta finish that up tomorrow, probably the next day as well, but it's underway. So um, tomorrow, going to get the step van, worked on at the diesel mechanic uh, in the morning, 9 a.m. I'll certainly make a video about that. That will be tomorrow's vlog.